going to the bakery. We got what we needed for this assignment. Exercise your expectations. That's a tongue twister, by the way. So the assignment is forget the rules, eat a dessert as for breakfast. <laughs> we don't mess around. Look how big this thing is. <laughs> like, look at my hand. <laughs> Uh, it reminds Nadine of a, a Dutch cake called Tompus, but I think it's meringue. What is it? It's meringue, right? Yeah, I yeah. Thought you. It's like fluff. You know that thing that you put on, mm. you could put on your bread? Soup. It's marshmallow fluff. Yeah, it's too you sweet. You really have to eat Yeah, right we're gonna do it because we're here with Surprise Me Surrender Trip. So you already don't know what kind of place you're going. You don't know what the theme is. Nadine is not excited about this at all after a night of clubbing and uh, you also get some excite, uh, assignments to get out of your comfort zone so let's get out of our comfort zone let's get nauseous what? you are already eating it without me what are you doing? <laughs> she just wants to get it over with she is not excited at all no, but I can't eat this why? tastes good man I don't know if tastes good I can't eat this. No? Mm -hmm. I can eat this. It tastes good, but not too much because I will be nauseous. But we didn't just do this assignment. We took it to a whole nother level. Because at the bakery, they had so much good stuff. And we actually bought a full bag with stuff for breakfast. We also found those donut, well, cream filled donut rolls that we had at the breakfast yesterday. I'm gonna try that one. Maybe it's better. Yeah? Mm. It's good? Mm -hmm. Show me the inside. Show me the inside. Mm. Can't wait to try that one. But I'm still finishing this one. <laughs> but that's definitely not all we got. <laughs> so we got some um, multi grain croissants. And we also got this big cream filled roll. So that's basically a dessert too, right? Or maybe not a Spain. I spent just breakfast. <laughs> and we got what is this? Oh, these. I think it's also savory puff pastry thingies. And more kind of savory croissants. We're going to eat everything, yes. Nadine's cutting the big cream filled thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Try it. Try it, try it, try it. Okay, this one is for you. We love cream filled things. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Eat it. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Yeah? It's okay. It's not great. <laughs> but she was already so grumpy about the meringue and it not being just a you know cream that we have on the tompus. Oh ew. I like that. And I'm having the small savory croissants. They're so good. Mm. Delicious, fresh bakery croissant. I'm going to try the cream filled donut thing. Mm. <clears throat> this one is really good. Mm -hmm. They put quite some lemon in the cream. It's really good. And donut is super fluffy and it was also a little bit warm when we got it. Mm. You can't really see the cream, but it's there. Mm. I'm going to try this cream filled thing. Mm. Oh no. It's okay. No. Nothing special. No. <laughs> Not at all. The cream filled donut was way well. Back in the metro and we are off to the beach for a lazy Sunday because we're quite tired of walking for the past two days. We're just gonna chill and eat. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. We're back at catwalk because we can't get enough of the party. No, <laughs> actually we are going to the beach. To the beach. To la, la playa? La playa. La playa. Vamos a la playa. The sun is super nice but it is extremely windy. Although yeah, it's okay actually. Between the buildings it was so windy man. Wow, oh, the weather is really nice, guys. It's not too windy at the beach, though. So that's really nice. 
Look at that. Oh, I love it. No better place for a lazy Sunday than the beach. Oh. Back at La Ramla and it is so cold, man. It's so very cold. windy. Yeah, Nadine has a nice, fluffy, warm coat. I am oh, but we freezing. I'm freezing. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 that we're going back to the same restaurant we went yesterday because that food was just too delicious and we're so looking forward to eating it again it's 6 p.m. we're going to have dinner very very early at least if they serve us this early and then we're going back to the room and watch a Bollywood movie well actually I already watched it but I'm going to let Nadine watch it okay so we have to cross the street <laughs> lovely jovely mysterious Barcelona side streets and this is not even a narrow alley it's already quite mysterious can you see that <laughs> no we were too early the kitchen opens at seven so we are just going to a little cafe shop coffee shop but look how cute this looks you really need to step into the side streets of La Rambla because they have really cute places over there Warm tea. we're back at the restaurant again this is the name Teresa Carles and because this morning's assignment was such a fun start of our day we're going to do another one so control your control freak travel to discover pick a local restaurant we're in a local restaurant sit down and order the third dish of the menu without checking Google Translate or anything. Are you up for it? Well, the thing is, everything is translated in English in most restaurants, so I'm just going to pick a dish off this menu, and I know everything is going to be good. This dish looks is amazing. And I'm I want to go for a salad. This is the salad menu. And the third salad would be Teresa goes to Tokyo. So, Goma Wakame. I'm guessing seaweed, cannon, asazuke, macerated cucumber, daikon, cherry tomatoes, golden sesame, macerated tofu. Sounds good. And a sauce made of rice vinegar, mirin, and soya. I'm down for the challenge, man. We're just going to order this. It wouldn't be my first pick because there are so much delicious dishes on the menu. Like, literally, I think we would have to return for a whole week to try everything because it all sounds so delicious. But I'm going to take the salad because control your control freak. Nadine is also controlling her control freak and she is going to order this Mar and Mountain. Mar and Mountain of corn and bolitis idolis meatballs. So I guess some veggie meatballs with young coconut rabas and a surprising dark veggie sauce with a touch of ratafia. We literally have no idea what this is. What is a rabas? What is a ratafia? The mystery, man. The mystery. Can you take the mystery, Nadine? <laughs> she has faith since yesterday that every single dish will be delicious, so we'll see. Nadine's dish arrived, so I guess it's meatballs and gravy and a little bit of veggies or something. We'll see what the culinary critic thinks of this dish <laughs> when she tries it. But first, Instagram. My dish arrived as well, so lots of tofu and sweet seaweed. I'm going to add the dressing. Let's do this. Miss Culinary Critic. What is the verdict? It's delicious. Yeah, it is? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, are you happy with the dish? I'm really happy. We will have to order some extra food, guys, because honestly, this is not enough for me. You know, the size of my salads, and this is definitely not enough to fill my tummy. And this is also definitely not enough for Nadine. <laughs> but it definitely got us out of our comfort zone, because we would never order these dishes in general. And we are trying something new now, and we also get to order a side dish of tapas to you know make it uh, the portion big enough so mission accomplished I guess <laughs> mm. Mm. I actually really like the salad you know why because I don't eat sushi anymore ever since I stopped eating fish and it has the seaweed salad I don't know with the dressing and everything it just reminds me of sushi mm. If you're here and you're craving sushi and you don't eat it anymore, try the salad, man. We ordered some Thank extra you. black rice with veggies and uh, soy aioli. I'm going to try it. I have some aioli over here. 
Mm. So tasty. I think this is the best dish I've eaten here. Wow. Especially that aioli. Oh my gosh. Mm. It's so good. What do you think, Miss Culinary Critic? No? You're not impressed? Really? Not as impressed as you are. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. But I think it's good. It's good? It's mm -hmm. delicious? Mm -hmm. Nadine just mentioned that she really likes it, that they're not afraid to season their dishes. So there are lots of spices in there. Well, enough salt. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's good. Mm -hmm. Okay. It tastes a little bit like a the veggie version of paella. We can't eat any paella because every paella features some kind of seafood. Mm, this is really, really good. I'm very impressed. Mm. This jacket is definitely not warm enough for Barcelona. But this time of year, it's so cold. Can you hear the wind? Oh, guys, I'm dying. Going back to the hotel. We're going to watch Bug Milk of Bug because I saw the movie, but I think didn't see the movie yet, and she is interested to watch it. So that's what we're doing right now. Well, 10 minutes later, we're both falling asleep. This is not gonna work. We're just gonna go to bed. Wow, this little spot in the park is like you just ended up in a theme park, but it's just in a park. If you enjoyed this vlog, you can always put a thumbs up. And if you would like, whoa, whoa, what is happening? Uh, if you would like to travel with me and Nadine tomorrow in uh, Barcelona, click that subscribe button. And then I will see you next time, my friend. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.